Hi guys! Happy summer solstice! Oh my gosh, it's here! It feels great today. There is a little extra sunlight, so please enjoy that um, if you are here in Canada. Anyways, uh, today we are going to be doing our reading, reading just for cancers, for the sign of cancer. Um, my best friend is a cancer and my papa was a cancer and they are an awesome sign. So I'm going to be doing this monthly for, or not, sorry, not monthly, but uh, each sign is going to get kind of uh, a reading done at the beginning of their season. So it's uh, some messages from the angels. We have a few different decks that we're going to be pulling from today. Um, so there's a little bit of relationships, a little bit of just like what's going on, career, like all that kind of stuff. And then just some maybe things we can work on to heal uh, you guys. So today I was guided to pick for you guys Moldivate. This, or sorry, Moldivite. This is one of my favorite stones. Uh, it's about transformation, uh, uh, transformation, acceleration, uh, spiritual evolution. It cleanses your your energy. It protects you. It brings good luck, um, wish fulfillment. It's kind of earthing. It's just a really great stone. I love it. I love holding it. I love wearing it. Um, if you definitely want to work on your um, psychic abilities or if you're an indigo child you should work with this stone it's really great so that's the stone for your reading and month and before I get into it I'm just gonna say an affirmation with you guys and by the way Archangel Michael is protecting this session right now for us and um, we have a whole set of angel team here so they want you to say, I trust. I trust what is meant for me will never pass me by. I trust that God and the universe have not abandoned me and all my desires. I trust in divine timing of the universe and that it will bring me what I want. I trust, I trust, I trust. Perfect. Okay. Uh, let's see what we got going on for you guys for cancer. I love cancer. Um, I like that your sign reminds me of um, a yin yang. And my papa used to always wear a little crab um, gold cancer necklace. And I used to really love that and cherish that. Okay, what do we got going on for Cancer? Well, for starters, you guys have two of abundance. Life may be feeling a little out of balance right now. You could be working on multiple jobs or trying to make changes into your dream career. It's important to keep things light and stay in touch with your inner child. Make your work playful and multitasking with a positive attitude can bring good results yeah so a few of you are like feeling like you're juggling everything right now um but hang in there like they said you can also bring in um archangel there's a few that want to come through uh raphael Zedekiel, and as real because we're talking about transformations um but anyways if you're feeling a little out of balance right now get out ground yourself um just they really want you to use positive words to describe your workload it's really going to help um bring positivity into it and um cracking jokes like uh, just making light of your actual situation. Um, I'm hearing like maybe play music at work. I'm hearing this is very work related. Very work related. But it's going to be good for you guys. And, and it 
because you're doing that, you will see that you'll start excelling and you'll start adjusting to it. And then the workload will even. And you can always ask the angels to help you with your workload. If you're feeling a little overwhelmed, and then you'd be amazed at the help that comes in. Okay, um, so you guys got three of action. So things are working out beautifully. Now that your ships have come in, it's time to decide what you want. Um, what will be your next big project? Will you continue building upon your success or move on to something entirely different? Be willing to travel. It could be necessary. Interesting. Well, if you are traveling, call in Archangel Raphael to get you there safely. Um, but I, there, I... I'm being told and I'm seeing people actually like transforming. So sometimes travel is not just about, um, I do see someone getting an opportunity and getting to go overseas. Um, sorry, they were just uh, giving me um, some names. Uh, so yeah, there are some people that may be going overseas and it's work related and it's actually going to be more in the other field, like you're going to kind of move on to something new. Uh, for the rest of you, you're just going to learn how to like transform and kind of bring everything together and that's really going to help with that balance, that, that yin yang, I'm really, uh, really showing me that today. Um, Okay, perfect. Uh, so yeah, be willing to travel if it comes. I, I see the person that's going overseas. It's going to be very good for you. Uh, three of emotions. Wonderful news is on its way. Announcements regarding engagements, pregnancies, um, birth, graduations are all going to be revealed. This will be an exciting time with friends um, and communities of like-minded people. It will draw you closer to one another and it brings exciting new beginnings, happiness, and just all good around the corner. So, um, yes, I definitely see, um, see someone I see one of you getting pregnant in like Leo season um, I see someone having a their your so your child is gonna be a Leo um, sorry um, a Alana, whoever Alana is, I've, I've had two messages for you today. So one of that is the moving um, across, that, that's for you, the overseas opportunity. And there was a message that came through for you um, earlier this morning for me, but I apologize. Um, there was a, a lot going on and I, I wasn't able, but I will post it in the comment below if I remember or just reach out to me on um, IG if you want. Anyways, uh, continuing on, I've delivered that message. Um, yeah, so I see the pregnancies happening. Um, obviously, there's graduation all around. Congratulations, uh, class of 2019. Um, yeah, I see like champagne being pop, uh, pictures being taken, graduation. Oh, it's such exciting and fun, fun times. Um, yeah, like your your marks are gonna come back positively. Like you're gonna have a great time at the like event, like the dance. Like um, I just see like good fun, and it's gonna be like a it's gonna be a good summer before you go to like your next adventure. So that's really exciting. Um, yeah, and I just see like you're going to really enjoy the, the new people you're going to meet, um, like when you're away at school and stuff. 
it's just going to really like open you up and you're, like, you're just going to really thrive in that environment. So that's awesome. Okay, so there's some happy changes on the way. Um, somebody has like wished and prayed to their angels for this. Like I'm hearing for a long time. Um, you just like you never gave up faith like and like it's coming to you. Yeah. I'm not going to ruin a surprise, but it's coming to you and like it's coming to you during your season too. And like, this is just your time to shine. Like, um, it was like a full moon. It's summer solstice. It's your birth. Like, are you, I, I think you're turning 30 too. So yeah, I just see like great success for you. I think like you're even going to get a promotion at work. I'm getting a Debbie, Debbie coming through. Um, okay, I'm gonna move on, guys, to a different um, section now. Let's look, look into some relationship for you guys. Um, okay, what do we got going on? Um, whew, felt fire sign, hot there. Ooh, definitely. Um, someone might be dealing with an Aries. And they're, um, oh, they're passionate. They're passionate. That's why you are like, can't get this person out of your head. Interesting. Um, okay, so I'm hearing uh, that, you know, sp spiritual beliefs, like uh, your backgrounds, they, um, they're, they're just different, right? Um, but I'm not hearing that it's not going to work or anything. I just, I just feel like it's challenging. Um, but maybe that's like a path you are supposed to, um, to, to, to be on right now is what they're saying. I was going to say travel, but they're, they're saying that that's kind of where you're supposed to be right now. Um, but yeah, this person is like fiery and passionate um, can you tell us anything else, Spirit, maybe, um, about that to help that person? Is there anything else we can tell them? Jamie, Jamie, Jamie. Jamie, um, an engagement. Uh, maybe your name's Jamie and you're going to get engaged. Oops, I hope I didn't ruin that surprise. <laughs> Oops. Anyways, you'll still be super surprised. Um, but yeah, Jamie, there's a, an engagement coming. Okay. Anything else, uh, Spirit, for our Cancerians here? Um, it's safe for you to love again. Okay, so... You were hurt. Um, okay, so an amazing trait about you Cancerians, you Cancer people, um, is you have, like, such big hearts and, like, you're truly, like, empathetic and, like, you're, like, you feel the emotional, like, emotions. Um, so I think you were hurt by someone in the past, but like, it's okay to let them in again. So maybe you need to do a little bit of, um, chakra cleaning or, um, just letting go in general. So maybe write it out, let it go, maybe voice it to someone. Um, yeah, just, uh, just. You, you have to, you have to forgive, you have to forgive and, um, but it, it's okay to let them in now. I'm not quite sure, but they did something that it really hurt. Like it didn't sit well with you, but they're saying it's safe for you to love again. Um... Jackie, there is a new love coming for you. Um, romantic feelings, uh, going to be getting to know each other. It's going to be lots of passion. Um, 
Trust. <laughs> okay, but pay attention to red plates. But yes, new love for you, and it looked promising. Okay, anything else, spirit? True love. This is, uh, this is it. This is a divine, um, uh, so true love and it's, so someone's coming in, but it's related to your career and finances. Um, Spirit, can you give me a little more on that? Okay, so maybe you're not in a relationship with this person right now. Or like, maybe you guys didn't, like, move in together or something because um, of, like, finances and career. And, like, you guys just need to, like, build a little bit more on your own. Um, but this is true love and it's worth waiting for. Adam and Amanda. Uh, oh, okay, one more, and then, um, oh boy, that really went right under my desk. Forgiving and learning. So they're saying this is kind of for all of you guys in relationships. Um, just uh, really let go this season and enjoy the summer and kind of flirt. Um, it's your birthday month, you know? Like, enjoy, enjoy, like, have fun. Archangel Michael is always with you guys and he's protecting you. So when you're feeling a little overwhelmed, a little stressed, you're feeling like unbalanced, you can always call him in to help you. Okay, so um, you're going to maybe need to change your diet. Um, they're saying uh, vegetarian. So... I'm seeing someone like actually starting to get sick now from what they're putting in their body. Like they're trying to eat uh, meat still. And like they're actually, it's like their body can't even digest it anymore. It's causing a lot of like internal issues. You might actually want to seek a physician regarding that. Julie. Uh, but yes, um, like, or like if you're going to see like a naturopath, they're going to tell you that you need to change your diet. Uh, it's going to be um, more like plant-based. Uh, release. So you need to like really just like release, um, visualize your success. So when you're, when you're feeling like it's not going to happen, because I'm, I'm, I'm feeling right now, like, you know what? I was once at a point in that, in my life like that too. And it does, it all happens. It all comes together. Trust, visualize success. Um, you can do it. You can do it. It's, it's just a little bit of a challenge, but you can do it. You guys are meant for success and it's coming to you. If you ever get nervous, just focus on service. Um, I know you guys all, like, care a lot about people and stuff. So, like, I'm hearing, like, nurses and caregivers. Um, yeah, you're in a lot, of, a lot of different healing fields. And if you ever get nervous, just focus on service and remember, like, what did you truly come here to do? And they say that that's going to that's gonna help you. Um, okay, so I think that I'm going to stop the messages there. Um, if you ever want a reading with me, you can just look me up on uh, Tap This Healing Center on Instagram. Uh, so they want to close out with a little affirmation for you guys today, and it is, I am worth loving. This is a powerful, powerful affirmation. So I want you to open your arms wide. And say, I am willing to let love in. It is safe for me to love. Let love in, let love in, 
let love in. Perfect, guys. Well, to all my cancers, uh, I hope you guys have a great birthday month and season. Um, and enjoy. It's all coming to you.